Hello everyone, welcome to part 2. Let's play Super Mario Bros. 3X. Pretty cool ROM hack, I must say, like I said before. Anyways, let's do Iggy's Castle. Like, I say like later on, I might start using save states because I'm going to soon get to those parts where there's some pretty little jumps. Okay, I have a mushroom. That's good, that's good. I mean, still, this game is quite easy. It's too bad I can't spin jumps. So I would have cleared these swamps. Well, actually, I still could, but you get the idea. Oh god, yep, good. Okay, this almost reminds me of the third fortress in Mario 3, like the one in the ice world. Except he didn't have these rolling dry bones yet. Yeah. Okay, I gotta get that P switch somehow. I gotta get up here. Uh oh, tap taps. You can't kill him. I mean, your fire goes right through him. Why? I don't know. I would expect, like, like dissipate the fire. But, you know, ghosts go right through them. Apparently, they're ghosts. I can't explain it either, but whatever. I guess because it's a custom sprite and all. Okay, good. Got that switch. Alright, oh, that P switch should now be down. Because since I got those switches solid, this one's gonna start flipping. And there, and I can get the P switch. That's a lot of them on you. And get in here. Okay, this is where I'm gonna stay stay because I always hated these kinds of jumps, but why won't even need to load? Ceilings. Well, you hit the ceiling, you drop down right away. It's gravity for you. Oh, shit, boos. Hate them. And we gotta hit down. Unlike Superman 64, that these floors you gotta actually drop that can help you out. Yeah, I'll get a one up. Batch the full bill, of course. There. That's what you need to switch for. You got there. Okay, good. Ah, boss time. That's a wait a minute, that's not Iggy. That's Larry. Okay, that's what his wand does, shoots lightning from the sky. So into the same lightning as Sumo Koopa's release. Therefore they should be quite easy to dodge. And very easy to defeat. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the hacker forgot to change the names. Because that's obviously Larry. Whatever's Larry's castle, Iggy's gonna be in it. So yeah, let's go to stage two, which is the desert world. No surprise there. Alright, let's do this. Gotta watch out for these blocks. It's pretty easy to tell which are the fake ones. Just gotta watch carefully. The fake ones do not shine. They're dull. That gives you a pretty good indicator who's going to attack you. Oh, what up? Gimme, gimme, gimme. There we go. Got spikes. I can't do the spin jump, therefore I can't bounce off of them. I actually had to dodge. Nice use of the spikes, though. At least it's not all munchers. Uh oh, Cobra has to spit fire. Oh, fine. Where does this take me? Take me somewhere good. Let's get plenty of coins, I hope. Oh, that's plentiful. Trust me, the more one ups, the better. Because I don't think the levels have checkpoints. If they do, it's very far, few in between. Move faster, Pokey! Alright, let's go. Now, the Cobras are custom sprites too, but they are quite easy. There we go, that's the end of the level. Easy enough. Now, Mushroom House, just in case I wanted to get some power ups. There, in case you need them. But I can't store any power-ups like a Super Mario World, therefore, I had to tough it out. Eh, Desert World 2 seems quite easy. 
some water and the bombs for our plants. Nothing I can't handle. And Goomba spawning pipes. Some narrow jumps, which I can easily use the Koopas for. There. That was actually quite easy. I've not done the level yet. Still got more to go. There. I'm getting the hang of this. Remember, hold Y and B so that you can clear these gaps. Hold Y alone, you'll still fall through. Look, sand! Oh, bouncing blocks, like a Mario 3, and this one gave me a flower. Okay, good, a platform for me to bounce on. This reminds me of another desert stage in Mario 3. I think it was 2-2. So if this one had more water and no very little quicksand. Oh well. It's just the same concept. The Desert Pyramid! Oh my god. Yep, this hack has a pyramid level too. Okay. Okay, oh wait a minute, there's a dead end. That means you actually go up this pipe. I mean, a lot of people get confused, like thinking, didn't I just go down that pipe, just get in the pyramid? But apparently, there's an upper floor. It fooled me too the first time I saw it. Whoa! Okay, I can't break that. I need these. Okay, I'm gonna let the fuzzy beetle go through. There, yeah, clear it out in case I want to go back. I don't think I will. I don't think I saw anything like constituted a, a, a puzzle. There, I can just use a buzz beetle. Hey, let me put the good use here. Hey, actually found work. Okay, those blocks that don't shine, I cannot break these with a buzzy beetle. I need a P switch. Luckily, there's one right here. Here, now I'm going this pipe. Ooh, coins! Gimme, give gimme, give gimme! Do you want the coins now? I got actually 1,000 coins out here. Oh, I forgot to hit down. I like those slim kill these things. Oh, oh, this bat's not getting away. This not... Ah, that got away. This one ain't. Okay, the upside down buzzy beetles that spin into you. They're here too. Nice touch. Some of these sprites are custom, but at least they're hacked pretty well to reflect the original enemies from Mario 3. I like that touch. That's our world 3. Let's go. I think I'll do one more level like this one, and then I'll stop. Oh god. 2-4 from Mario 3. That would be a pretty good assumption after you're seeing these chumps. I hate chumps in this. Come on, give me another flower. Fine then, don't give me another flower. Maybe tough it out on my own. Huh? You like that? Oh well. I should have no problems. Ooh, a star! Oh, fine, I'll spare the chump's life. Sadly, like Mario 3, the stars do not last long at all. Too bad, huh? I would have loved to do some overkill. Oh well, I guess I can't. Okay, this is somewhat like 2 3 from Mario 3. The ending part, anyway. You gotta use these shells to get to the exit. I love how it combined like several levels at once. And like that little gap of the lines of coins. It was someone like 2 4 from Mario 3. Like, you're in kind of combination of different types of levels. I like that touch. Okay, I'm gonna stop the video right here. And next part, we're gonna do Desert World 4. See ya.